Hi friends, welcome, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to do a updated Commit 30 flip through and just show you guys all the things that like has happened since the last time I did a flip through. I don't even remember when my last flip through was. It was probably like two months ago or something. Yeah. Thank you, honey. Daddy, buy some Yes, daddy will bats. buy some more, okay? He wants his dad to buy some more bats. We bought these like bats to hang on our wall, but they keep falling off. And he brought me like literally the whole pile of them. Um, but anyways, so I wanted to do a commit 30 flip through really, really quickly and just show you guys like all the new updates that I did inside of my planner right now. It is October. So my planner is super decked out for Halloween spooky season. Um, I just have like a whole bunch of like little cute collages, including like, you know, Lydia, Brighter Frankenstein. I have like this Dracula die cut here. I have Billy from Scream here. I have this Planner Monkey Co. sticker, which I think is so cool. It just says True Crime Junkie. And then this is from Planner Monkey Co. It just says I Feel Dead. And, um, and then me and my family for um, spooky season, the, my son's first spooky season. And I just love that picture. Um, we have since taken updated pictures, but that will forever be my favorite one just because it was his first one and our first one as parents. And then I have a magnetic pen here. This is from Planner Monkey Co. It just says dead inside, but caffeinated. Um, and you guys don't forget, you guys can use my code Keish15 to save. I'll put the link inside of the inside of the description. Um, and you guys can receive my cute freebie with your order. I have my new freebie here actually it's sitting inside of my Hobonichi Weeks. And you guys can actually get this freebie with your order when you use code Keish15. But let's just get right into it, shall we? Because I feel like uh, this thing is so huge, you guys. It is so huge and it is so full of love and it's so chunky and I freaking, freaking love it. Um, the only new thing that I did change was the clear cover here. I used to have like the star jelly one, but um, I don't have that one no more. This one's new. It's from Amazon. I think it was like $8 or something. And, um, I do have an Amazon storefront too, with all like the stuff that I buy from Amazon for my planners and like other things. So I'll go ahead and link that down in, inside of the description as well. It'll be underneath the, um, commit 30 like items. And so you'll be able to like see like all the stuff that I bought from my commit 30 inside of that category. Um, but yeah, that's the only thing that I bought that is new. It is nice and perfect it fits perfectly it is not too tight let's take it out of here it's not too tight um it literally fits perfectly and i was thinking like ooh, it would be perfect with like that cute little like clasp here and like use it as like just this by itself but i never take this anywhere so i'm like why would you even do that but yeah and then also it has like a pen loop here and yeah, it's just like perfect fit. It's not too tight. It's a little bit loose and like overhang and everything, but like that doesn't bother me because I would rather have overhang than have a very super tight cover and then it's awkward. So yes, that is what, that's the only thing that's new on my Commit 30. And then let's just do a flip through now. Everything here is still the same in the front because everything is permanent. <laughs> So there's no changing things here, um, which I'm so fine with because I love, 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 love this planner. Let's just go ahead and flip change this around. Okay. But yeah, I freaking love this planner so much. Let's go ahead and like take off the tension from that. <laughs> okay. But yeah, I freaking love this planner. It's perfect. I would not change anything inside of this planner at all. But yeah, let's just go ahead and then I'll just do like a very quick flip through of the whole entire year, um, even though I have showed it before. But I just want you guys to see like the full entire weeklies that I have in here. And as you guys know, or as a majority of you guys know, if this is your first time watching this, um, pl this flip through, um, I have been in this planner since the middle of March of this year. So all of this that you're seeing now is actually back planned. And you guys will see like when I like really, really started it. But like all of this is perfect. I love it. Um, it 
it's so amazing i love this planner so much there's so much love in here and i oh, i just love it so see here it says commit 30 delivery so i've been inside of this planner since march 17th and then everything that you just seen um all the way back to january here is all back planned but everything from like there on is all like real time planning and I just have like pictures, I have sticky notes, I have all these different things in here. And I can't say that I love it enough because I really, really do. It's such a wonderful planner. And this is my um, main planner. So this just stays on my desk. And I update this wonderful, wonderful planner every single day. And I just make sure that it's updated. And then anything else of this is like really supplemental. Um, I always update this one first before I update any of my other planners. So this is basically my catch all planner. And it's like the perfect size for it. I always feel like I fill up the spaces nicely. Um, and I can memory plan and still keep everything in here super, super organized. And then sticky notes. Sticky notes again. Here's like, this is the week I got my little passport tea and I wanted to just like put that in here. Here's a memory with my mom. I have two memory sticky notes in here. So just all the love inside of this planner is insane. And I love to flip through it I can't wait until the end of the year to like do a whole entire like planner flip through because then you just get like a whole entire year. And I love that. This month I didn't have a monthly goal. When was this? July. I think of that month I was just kind of like, <laughs> I don't really have a goal this month. More sticky notes. This month I did no spend challenge. I think I did pretty, pretty good. This week we got sick for a couple of days. Love this so much. Oh my goodness. I can talk about how many, I can keep saying that over and over again, but it's so true. I love this planner. I need to finish updating this. I did not finished updating the stickers for September, but most of September I did pretty good at not spending money. I'm doing like a no spend challenge, I guess, basically every month because <sighs> everything's so expensive <laughs> and everything adds up so quickly. It's crazy. But yeah, this is the week my mom was here. Oh wait, I don't think I did. Did I do a planner flip since then? I don't think so. I don't know when the last time I did a planner flip was, but so we'll just do it for September. Um, so the month of September here, here is um, my monthly overview, just a couple of things, like had an appointment, birthdays, my mom came, um, our 14 year anniversary, the first day of fall, bills, um, my aunt, my aunt's arrival here at the bottom. Here's the first week, so September 4th to the 10th. This is when my mom came, and most of the time we were just spending time with her, and this is basically just all like a little bit of memory planning with her, um, because like I said, we were spending the majority of the time with her, and just slowing down, soaking it all in. So yeah, and then I do miss walking. We actually went to this local like walking, like track where you can go walking and we haven't been back since and I'm kind of sad about it <laughs> but and then here's the 11th to the 17th um cut my bangs that week apparently <laughs> and then we were again we were just spending all the time with my mom because she was leaving that Saturday um and we actually were walking as you guys can see here it says watching walker 
is a TV show and we really, really enjoyed it. And we actually finished it that Tuesday and then just spending all the time with my mom as much as we could. And we just hung out all, all day long until she left that Saturday. We went to the dinosaur park that week um, because my son was super sad after my mom left. So we took him there just to like cheer him up a bit. So that was the week of September 11th to the 17th. This week here, um, it was the, the week of the first day of fall. It was also our 14th year anniversary. And yeah, this whole week was just kind of chilling and hanging out. I ordered my 2024 weeks that week as well. Um, I managed to work out three times that week. Here's a picture of my son. We baked some pumpkin cookies that night and he loved this little like cutout thing from the box. So he like took a picture and he's just so cute. Um, this week here, this is the week of Monday the 25th, September 25th to October 1st. So this week here, same thing. It's just filming videos, cleaning, hanging out, buying stuff, coffee runs, pizza night, cleaning. Um, we actually didn't make it to our general checkup, so we went ahead and canceled that. Um, my aunt came this, this Saturday, September 30th. She got in around 12.30 p.m. And then right after we went to Bucky's and then we went to Spirit Halloween, we went to Michael's. My son was so excited to see her. He hasn't seen her since we left back in May. So we were just all so excited to see her and we just loved her visit. Um, and then Sunday the 1st, um, my son, we decided to make my aunt some pumpkin pancakes and she loved them so much. It was her first time trying pumpkin pancakes and she enjoyed them. Dalton loves making them, so he was, he had so much fun showing her how he made them. Um, we went to downtown Austin. We went to the co-op store because she wanted to buy like a Longhorns t-shirt with like the Matthew McConaughey saying from um, Days and Confused, like that, all right, all right, all right. So we took her down there and then we went to the Austin gift store, which is like very local to us actually. It's probably like a five to 10 minute drive away from us. And we took her there. That was our first time there. And we were like, what? This is literally not too far from where we... Okay, I'll get you some more water. Um, but it's not too far from where we always, where we go to Sam's Club. So we were like, what in the world? That is so crazy. So we love going there. Um, we actually forgot to watch Sister Wives that night. And so, yeah, that was basically the entire week here. Um, was the highlight of the week was my aunt coming. And then that was the end of September. Here's a no spend challenge that I haven't even filled in yet. I mean, eventually I can, cause I can look back at the days and be like, okay, I spent money this day. I didn't spend money this day. So here is um, October's monthly layout. And then just a whole bunch of things. Like I said, we have so many people, or I think I mentioned this in my last video. But um, we have so many people coming to visit us the month of October. So like I said, my aunt was here from the 30th, September 30th to October 3rd. So that already passed. And then this coming weekend, my um, cousin and her spouse are coming and they'll be here for a whole entire week. And then literally a few days later, my mom and my little sister are going to be back again to be here throughout Halloween. And so we're so excited to have like all the visitors because we miss everybody. Oh, cat must say. <laughs> yeah, he's saying the cat. So he's saying cat and Navajo. <laughs> Masse. How do you say cat and Navajo? Masse. Yeah, it's so cute. And so we're so excited. It's also our two year wedding anniversary and then Halloween, of course. We're so excited. I can't believe it's already October. Um, we wait all year for it to come and then it's here and then you're like, what in the world? What's happening? Um, so this is the first week, um, technically inside of October. So October 2nd to the 8th, um, the first week that we like went out and did stuff, we went to the pumpkin patch that week. And then here's a picture of my son and then us as a family. I just have the song here. I always say like the Adams family theme song is perfect for our last name. So it just says they're creepy and they're kooky, mysterious and spooky. They're all together ooky, the Gorman family. <laughs> So I think that's so cool. I love that saying. I think we have been saying that since like the first year that we were like a family or my first, my son's first year, um, first Halloween. And I just think it's hilarious. So that's kind of like our new theme song for our family and, uh, or it's not new, but you know, for us it's perfect. 
Um, but yeah, so here's just a memory thing here. I just put that we enjoyed having my aunt here for a few days and we were just so sad that she left. And so that was last, this is last week actually. Um, Monday, we just kind of hung out all day. We had a start a coffee date with my aunt over at Starbucks. She treated us out to Starbucks. We went to Barnes and Noble. We dropped my husband off early that morning and then picked him up that evening. And then we actually put up some chili that morning inside the crock pot. So that evening we had chili with cornbread. And then we finally watched Sister Wives. And it was perfect because it was like we had the very like good food. We had the good food. We had the good show. And my aunt has never seen Sister Wives. So she was like... <laughs> She was like, oh my goodness, there is so much drama in this. So it was so much fun just like telling her like all the updates and like things that happen and blah, 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 blah. So that was so fun too. And then Tuesday, that was, um, my aunt was leaving that evening. So basically we just hung out all day. Um, we ate my son's favorite breakfast that morning. My aunt never seen um, Pride and Prejudice. So of course, like that's my favorite movie. So I went ahead and showed it to her and no, she loved it. Okay, let me go get you some water. Hang on guys, I'll be right back. Let's go get some water. Go ahead. I'm not going to cut anything out too. I just want to go ahead and upload this. Okay, let's go. Okay, guys. I'm coming, I'm coming. I got my water too. But, um, anyways, let's hop right back into this actually. Um, so yeah, my aunt really loved watching Pride and Prejudice. It was her first time, so it was fun to show her like my favorite movie. And then, um, my son played bubbles with her outside. They went for like a little walk around where we live, and then she got ready and then we had to drop her off at the airport and it was so sad. <laughs> um, she got delayed for a little bit by like 20, like 25 minutes or something. Um, and then we took my son to Target because he was so sad. So we took him to his favorite place and of course it's Target, like his mom. And so we took him to Target just to like walk around. We got some Starbucks and we just, um, I think he got like a little small toy or something. And so, yeah. And then we came home and then... Wednesday obviously it's like the day after my aunt left so it was just like a super lazy day just like kind of getting caught up with like your chores and stuff and like little things that you need to do around the house um and it was also sticker day at Dutch Bros I FaceTime with my mom and then also my my aunt that left the day before and then also my other aunt um they were all together so we went ahead and FaceTime with them all day and then the 5th, um, that day there was a thunderstorm. We went on a little bike ride that day to enjoy the weather. We put up some more spooky decor around our, our home while watching The Nightmare Before Christmas. My husband came home and said that he was off Friday to Sunday. So we were so excited about that. Um, let me put this back over here and then here this is just a sticky note my husband found this over at our local grocery store HGB and it's just the um shape of Texas the sticky notes so I thought it was hilarious to put pay toll fees because we needed to pay the toll fees so it's just sitting on this Texas sticky note which I think is hilarious um and then Friday we had breakfast at McDonald's because my son wanted it we actually had breakfast at McDonald's two times in a row, the Friday and the Saturday. My son's obsessed with their hash browns. So when he woke up Saturday, he was like, can we eat McDonald's again? So we're like, why not? And then, um, but anyways, so Friday 
we had breakfast at McDonald's. We went to the park because it was a cool morning. We went to Target. And then right after we went to Dutch Bros. We had a lazy afternoon and just hung out at home all day. And then um, I also had my A6 Kin board delivery. And then Saturday, like I said, that morning, Dalton wanted McDonald's again. So we went there. We went to HEB to go buy some groceries and stuff. We went to Dutch Bros. And then we went to the pumpkin patch over at our local little pumpkin patch, like by the little coffee shop. And then my husband put up like the fencing cover around our back patio area and some more Halloween stuff. And that's what he did with my son while my son was playing bubbles. We tried chicken bu or buffalo chicken dip. It was okay. I felt like there was too much ranch. So I feel like I kind of have to tweak it a little bit. But overall, it was pretty good. Um, we had pizza that night and then we picked, well, um, we booked a little fall photo shoot for that Sunday because we seen the lady taking pictures over there at the pumpkin patch and I asked her if she had any openings and she's like, oh yeah, go to, go to my website. She sent me the link. We signed up for the next day. So we went, we had to pick out photos or outfits for our pictures. And then Sunday, October 8th, we just had breakfast, had coffee, we got ready. We went to the little our little photo shoot there at 11 and then I went ahead and sent some photos to CBS. Not the photos from the fall photo shoot but some other photos that I wanted to print. So I sent those to CBS and then right after our photo shoot and then sending pictures to CBS we went to go on a little coffee date over at Starbucks while we were waiting for our pictures at CBS. So we had a little coffee date at uh, Starbucks and it was nice and cool. And we sat outside and enjoyed our coffee and our, our little pastries. Um, and then on our way to Goodwill, or not to Goodwill, on our way to CVS, we stopped over at Goodwill just to browse because that's where you find the hidden gems. Um, I've been trying to find like a vintage Halloween sweater for like the longest time. I have not hit the jackpot yet. Um, so we went there to go browse to see if we could find anything good. Um, we did find a couple of things. Um, but yeah. Um, but yeah, we went to Goodwill because like I said, you find like gems there that are like one of a kind. So we went there to just to browse. Um, we put up some nachos in the crock pot, which was just like cheese and then ground beef, black beans and like all this like um, jalapenos and stuff like that. Cooked it in the crock pot for a few hours and then we had that for dinner. And then my husband had to run to HGB again. Um, because we needed to grab a couple more things that we forgot to grab this uh, Saturday morning. And then we watched Sister Wives at 9 o'clock. So that was that week. And then this, or this was last week, the October 2nd to the 8th. And then this is this week here. Um, but yeah, Wednesday, literally I haven't updated my planner yet because we literally didn't do nothing. So more than likely it's just going to be like another lazy day written down. Um and then today is Thursday, so I'll just go ahead and put that I filmed videos or whatever. But yeah, you guys, that is currently my flip through of my Commit 30. I hope you guys enjoyed this um, video. I love this planner so much. And I just love flipping through it and like holding it and just looking at all the memories and the love that I put into this planner. And I just, I, I, I adore it so much. But anyways, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will just chat with you guys in my next one. And I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. I appreciate, I, oh my lanta. <laughs> I appreciate you guys watching and I'll talk with you guys in my next one. Bye.